with the rushes. Oh, there's, um, I think last night they said they counted 55,000 fish or something like that passing the sonar. So I mean, with, you know, even, the, even though there's hundreds of people out here, there's thousands of fish to, you know, catch it. It's great. I don't know. Um, it's a lot easier than, uh, you know, fishing at the Russian or where the limit is only like three fish. Um, you know, you spend all your money, you know, getting your camping gear ready, you know, gas in the car, this and that. Even if you do, you know, a two day trip, um, it still, you know, costs you a lot. Whereas, you know, you can come down here, catch your household limit, you know, it's 25 a person, or 25 for the first person, then 10 for each additional member of your household. You can stock your freezer for the winter in one trip, you know, as opposed to a bunch of different trips to fill it. Uh, four, no, five feet across. Five feet round and about, I think it's like 16 feet long. Costco. It's like 115 bucks. One of the cheapest ones you can buy and it does, does the job just fine. Oh, I got four days and I'll bet you I'm still, I'm going to walk away with at least 30 fish. Um, it really depends. A lot of these do vary in size. I mean, compared, you know, there's a small, smaller ones over here compared to, you know, I'm, you know, playing a pretty good size one right now. Um, so it really depends on the size fish you catch. Um, if you're on the Kasilov and you catch your limit, you're probably gonna end up with 50 pounds less fish because all the fish are smaller over there. I wasn't going out as far as everybody else. Um, everyone else, you know, they got these huge long poles and they're trying to go as deep as they possibly can to get to like the middle of the river and there's no need. I mean, I sat behind a whole row of people and I was taking in three to four fish to their one. So, and they didn't really get a clue and move back. They just stayed where they were at. There's one lady who kept yelling at her husband, move back to where he's at. Did you listen to her? No. <laughs> I never buy salmon from a grocery store, so I don't know the price. <laughs> I've never bought a salmon from a grocery store in my life. Well, we just stick the net out there and they just swim into it and pull them in. We'll clean, clean most of them here and then we'll take them home. My wife will fillet them up, cut them into steaks, put them away in the freezer. That way we have fish for the winter. She doesn't waste any of it. She'll take the fish heads, make some fish head stew, or she'll put them in a salt and brine and let them sit for about a month and then they'll eat them. Her and her sisters will eat it with uh, seal oil. Uh, most of them are 20 to 30 pounds. And then we'll just take it home and fill up the freezer. There she is, she got one now. <laughs> My wife, she wanted to fish for the, for the winter. And uh, she's from a village and that's all they do during the summer is put away fish for the winter. And she got to have her fish in the winter. 